guys it's Nicole welcome back to my YouTube channel now today's video I'm gonna do like a one take vlog here so this video is about the BTS map of the soul tour being canceled um, they hit they released a statement yesterday on Weverse and I'm just going to read it briefly for you all, for you armies out there that didn't know about um, Big Hit canceling the Map of the Soul tour. Um, hello, this is Big Hit Music. We would like to provide some information regarding BTS Map of the Soul tour. Our company has worked hard to resume preparations for the BTS Map of the Soul Tour, knowing that all fans have been waiting eagerly and long for the tour. However, due to changing circumstances beyond our control, it has become difficult to resume performances at the same scale and timeline as previously planned. Therefore, we must announce the cancellation of the BTS Map of the Soul Tour. It's very sad because I was supposed to see them May 14th, 2020. Obviously it did not happen because of COVID and the pandemic and everything just kind of went to a screeching halt. So I got an email from Ticketmaster last night and you should receive your refund within 30 days. Um, so we will all be getting our money back but the sad part is is like we have to go through the Hunger Games to get our concert tickets. Like I had floor six seats. You guys know that because I made a video filming myself buying my Map of the Soul tickets. If you haven't seen it, I'm going to link it up um, in the YouTube cards and at the end of the video. It's probably one of the funniest videos I've ever made because I was so stressed out and you guys voted for it. You guys wanted it. So I filmed it and it got a lot of views. So. It just really bums me out because throughout this entire pandemic, like I got to look at my Map of the Soul tour tickets and it kept saying postponed, postponed. And then yesterday when we got that um, notice, they decided to cancel it. Um, and it's just sad. Like I was really looking forward to this Map of the Soul tour because I love the Map of the Soul 7 album. I did an album review on that album. That album slaps. Like, I love, there's so many fantastic songs, and I'm just so sad that I will never get to hear Filter, My Time, Moon, Inner Child, um, Ego, Shadow, Persona, like, all these songs, I just will never get to hear them because of this pandemic and everything. Like, I understand why they had to cancel it because... They're trying to look out for the safety of the boys and the stage crew, the staff, the fans. Like, I understand that. I do. And I respect them for doing that because we all have to look out for our own health. And I do want to shed some light. I know there's a lot of sad armies out there. But I just want to say that there will be another concert we just don't know when it could possibly be in 2022 or 2023 we have no idea but just don't lose hope I guarantee you that as soon as we get a hold of this pandemic and everyone gets vaccinated and all that stuff that we will get back to normal some someday I don't know when that day will be and we'll be able to see BTS again but I guess we just have to wait <clears throat> a little bit longer but um, I was on FaceTime with Ashley when I got the notification and her and I just kind of talked about it and it just really made me sad. <laughs> like I said, oh man, the map of the Soul Tour is officially canceled, y'all. Let me know what you guys think about all of this in the comments below. Um, it just sucks because, oh, I just, I've only seen BTS once. And I'm very grateful that I was able to see BTS once. I got to see them for the um, the Speak Yourself tour back in 2019. I flew to East Rutherford, New Jersey for the MetLife Night One show. And I had the most amazing time of my life. And I thought like when they released Map of the Soul 7 and they dropped the dates for the Map of the Soul tour, I was like, oh my God, I'm gonna see them again. And I was gonna see them in Orlando. So it was gonna be at Camping World Stadium. So I was literally gonna just be able to get in my 
my car and drive like super close, but it's okay. Ugh, I'm just bummed. Like, uh, it just sucks. I had so many plans on meeting people, but it is okay. You just gotta look at it like, hey, it's just kind of, I kind of saw it coming because of the Delta variant that's going around and the numbers are getting crazy. So they're just doing it for our safety and I get that. At the end of the day, you know, you just gotta worry about your health and it's okay. I know it sucks. Um, I Feel free to talk about it in the comments if you want. Um, I will be responding to the comments. I look at every single comment. Um, whoever comments on my videos, I look at them, I read them, I respond to everyone because y'all are so fantastic and amazing and I appreciate every single one of you for watching my videos and appreciating me returning to YouTube. It feels really good to be back um, because I missed you all. Anyway, let me know your thoughts about all of this in the comments below and let's chat it up. Let's talk about it. Let me know what you think and let me know what shows you were supposed to be going to. I was Orlando. Um, anyway, I love you all so, so much. Thank you all so much for watching this little video. I just wanted to pop in and post this video real quick. I love you all so much. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up for me. If you haven't already subscribed, you better be hitting that red subscribe button there. Okay, person watching this. And you better turn on those post notifications, hit that bell icon, and make sure you put on all notifications so you know when my videos go live. And you'll be the first one to watch them. Anyway, I love you all so much, and I hope to see your beautiful face in the next one. Bye.